to track a chilly start to 2024. We'll be near seasonal, which for wintertime is just cold. Definitely we'll want to stay layered up here. But again, we'll be seasonal, which is a nice trend after a record breaking hot 2023 for the new year. Hopefully we'll stay cooler here as we are tracking, especially today, the low average temperatures for our Monday for New Year's Day. It's going to be really kind of the coldest part of the forecast for this week as temperatures are even struggling into the 30s. We'll have cloud cover, winds from the north really keeping us down today. And the feels like is even likely below freezing for all of New Year's. But we're improving somewhat through the week ahead. We'll it be fairly seasonal. Really, temperatures should only be topping out right around the 40 degree mark. And you'll see that's right about where we are here this week. Even a little cooler possibly for some parts of this week ahead. Even though it's pretty quiet here, we will be tracking a few disturbances, mostly missing our area for this week. It's not until we'll get into about next weekend for the second week of January. That's where things really are looking to pick up now in the forecast. Our first round of uh, precip will be likely Friday into Saturday. Uh, rain and possibly a mix is uh, in the forecast for now. Have to get much closer for a better handle on that, but and that's where activity just begins to pick up here. We'll actually follow several systems after that. This is our outlook past the seven day forecast uh, into the week after this here again. Second week of January, uh, we'll be tracking more active pattern. Definitely want to get outdoor plans out of the way here for now, but we will want those layers as well as you're heading outside uh, as we'll be seeing temperatures getting seasonal for this first week. And it's not too bad still for the next few days ahead of that active pattern to get outside.